guys, how is on my camera? Hey guys, it's been ages since I recorded anything on my camera, but here I am recording. Speaking of recording, I should make sure the mic is on. Is it on? Yeah. Bit of a channel update. Um, so I guess I'll give all the news on like things that are coming up that you might be interested in. Thing one, I haven't done a face poll moments of the week yet because instead I did a video on why Hillary Clinton is going to be the next president. So if you missed that for some reason, you can go back into the video list and check that out and see my prediction in May as to what's going to happen in November. And we'll see in a few months time how I did. Thing two is I still haven't started on the Did Jesus Exist Yet? Mostly because last weekend I was writing the thing for Hillary Clinton. And, and then, oh, the other thing, uh, thing three, but we haven't come to it yet. So let's stay with thing two. Did Jesus Exist? Still in my head, mostly, but it's sort of ripening in there, it's cooking, things are getting connected. Actually, I watched a, a video by the, the Bible skeptic last night, and I was like, oh, that would be perfect for my intro video, because then I can cite him and some of the arguments that he makes about Zechariah, talking about the apocalypse and the way that pre-apocalyptic Jews viewed resurrection and, and the concept of the Messiah. Oh, this is perfect. So even if it's not getting typed out, it's still being turned up um, in here. And that's usually when I do my best work. Long thought pregnancies, and then a really beautiful thought baby. <laughs> Thing three, I actually have to check my uh, internet really quick because the details are in an email. Hold on. Holy crap, I had no idea it was going to take me long this long to find it. Ah, found it! That took way too long. But through the magic of editing, it took no time at all for you. So the big smile on my face is because I've done so many takes of this now that I'm not even taking it seriously anymore. So Saturday, the 14th of May, 9 p.m. That's UK time, 10 p.m. my time. I believe that's 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. My guest will be Professor Philip Moriarty, whose blog post I read in the last couple weeks that dealt with um, Thunderfoot and sexual dimorphism. And we're gonna be chatting about a couple things. We're gonna talk about um, how to science, how uh, peer review works and how it works into the process, the way that you're meant to use findings properly in a scientific context. And then we'll also have a, we've talked about talking about explaining why drawing a, a line of causality from a brain structure claim, unsupported, or a hormonal claim, unsupported in terms of social outcomes, why making those biological claims are so difficult to connect to social outcomes. What are all the other potential causes of variation that would need to be controlled for and accounted for in order to properly isolate biological determinism or sexual, bimorph uh, sorry, sexual dimorphism as an explanatory factor. And I, he's going to come at that from the science side. I'm going to come at it from the social science side. And maybe between the two of us, we can come up with a research design that no one could actually conduct, but at least theoretically, it could get us an answer that would give us something definitive about the relationship between physiology and social outcomes controlling for all the other explanations. And I'm not saying that there would be an effect. I'm saying we could maybe design together a study, a proposal that would actually make it possible to get at that effect. Not to say that there is that effect, but just to be able to observe it, to rule it out or observe it and rule it in. The last thing is that we're gonna have the Patreon hangout this weekend. Also, but not on the Saturday, the Sunday because that's when I tend to do it. It's going to be fifth, the 15th of May, and I'm going to be hosting it at 6 p.m. my time, and that's 5 p.m. UK time, which I think makes it 11 Eastern Standard and 10 Central, and moving that direction westward. I don't know if that's west, but it is in the map in my head. Like, the states are there, and then this is California, and that's New York. So when I do this, regardless of what the world says, to me, that's west. <laughs> I can't tell my left from my right. 
Uh, yeah, so we're gonna have the Patreon hangout and we'll probably do some more facepalm moments just to keep the topic a bit focused and give people an opportunity to react to current events. But of course there are always, you know, uh, it's patron led, patrons take part. And if you have some questions, then you know, you can bring them, we can have a discussion or anything else. It's your show guys, it's what you wanna do. And I will, as always, put a link to the hangout on the Patreon page so that only members can see it. Now, if you would like to join in the Hangout and ask some questions or do facepalm moments, whatever you want, it's for the patrons. I mean, I do facepalm moments just to keep things focused and give people a chance to react to something so that everyone has a chance to talk. But if you would like to join, then you can do so for the low, low price of one American dollar a month. Of course, if you'd like to give more, a $5 donation or $10 donation, I will be very humble and grateful, and I will continue to use it on things like software to improve the channel. But uh, mostly it's, you know, an opportunity for me to spend time with the people who are invested in my channel by investing time and attention in them and having a space for us to go beyond the digital screen into real life. So that's why I do my Patreon hangouts and they're quite fun. So please join if you'd like. If not, if you can't financially support the channel for any reason, it's not a problem at all. You can always watch it afterwards because I put it up for everyone to see. So it becomes more content that everyone can watch. I think those are the big things that I have to say. I will be traveling again near the end of the month. So um, my schedule, my upload schedule might get a bit shaky but you guys seem to roll with everything really well, so I'm not too concerned. Oh, and then I guess the last thing too is if you haven't noticed, I've started a new series that uh, came about as a result of the debate with Sargon, and that is How to Social Science 101. And in How to Social Science 101, we are discussing the philosophy of science, including ontology and epistemology. If you don't know what those words are, you should check out the series. And when I get to the point where I've covered all the philosophy, I think I'm going to break it up then into two different courses and do lectures on qualitative research methods and the other one on quantitative research methods. So I'll have like the 101 and then I'll have maybe like a, a 202 and a 203 that accompany it where I go more into the actual methods, um, the practical side of it so that people can understand how social scientists generate data and what they do with those data once they're done with them and how they can how we you and i can evaluate the empirical claims of social scientists and other scientists based on an understanding of quantitative approaches and qualitative approaches so that's the goal and now i think i'm definitely out of things to say i think there were five or four maybe i think i remember thing three thing three was a big thing Okay, guys, I've been Christy. You've been awesome. Have a great rest of the day. Thanks for watching all the way to the end of the video, and I will see you soon. Bye. Thing three. I had talked about thing, thing two, now thing three. Time to for thing, thing three. Thing three. Not take three. Thing, thing three. Thing three is that on Saturday, the 14th, of September, no, try this all over again. So 9 p.m. UK time, that would be 10 p.m. my time, minus six Eastern Standard Time would make it like 6 p.m. Yeah, that sounds about right. 21 minus six is 15, fuck, no, wait. Here are, are the pieces of information for this. Who? Professor Philip Mardiard. Try again. I will post it in the on the Patreon thingy and in the description box down below within a day or so. <sighs> Do this one again. Oh, I'm getting tired. Tired, 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 tired. Maybe. The way that, um, in, in this way, you know, I, I'm getting... <sighs> so I will be putting up a link in uh, Patreon on the website for uh, on my patrons. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Uh, so many takes. All right. This time I'm gonna do it. Last but not least is the Patreon Hangout that's gonna take place 
this Sunday um, on the, 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 the the that's the fifteenth. That's all, folks. <laughs> I I need to stop recording soon.